<laughs> so, um... What are your feelings right now, Polk? Let's see if we get some porn that you, uh... That you explain. Burn to the ground! Okay, he's... Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Burn to the Easy. But five's a good game. Mm. Uh, five's a good game. The, I'm gonna stand by that. Five's a good game. The weapons aren't the greatest, but it's still a good game. Okay, V, I'm just gonna tell you this, like, in, in the best way I know how. I'm an Eskimo, and you're selling me ice. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you have to also remember, I like bad things. I, I'm... Yeah. Oh, I could have said something <laughs> bad, but I, I, I don't think you would have let me live through it had I said what I was thinking. Uh-oh. And, and look, I'll say it for posterity's sake, but I don't mean this in any way, shape, or form, so please uh -huh. don't murder me. Uh -huh. I was like, is that why you married your wife? Ooh. Yeah, uh, again, that look, coming. It, it was Ooh. a low blow, and I, I was like, no, if I say this, I'm a dead man. Yeah. Quite possibly. Do you care? No! Well, <laughs> it's too bad, so sad. You might care later. Oh, don't tell me that. Don't tell me shit like that. Why not? <laughs> oh, God, no. I'm, I'm lit. Oh, for fuck's sake. You're, you are officially abusing your privilege. And your <laughs> All right, so I know Slash Man is not the weakness, so I think I don't have it. I'm willing to suffer through my. Um... Oh. I'm sorry, what? What just happened? Did the fucking platform just drop me? Yes. Yep. It did. I I have no fucking words for how I feel right now. Uh, pretty good, I'd say. I lose. Yeah, I lost my ball. Oh, yeah, ready you know, to watch the plane? No, I'm dead. <laughs> I didn't expect uh, the note to be that literal, but hey. Oh, okay, the plank is still out. We're still good. We're still, still good. working. <laughs> oh my god. Um, <laughs> what is the sound? And that is a good question! Make it stop, please? I can't. We still have 14 minutes of this thing! Amazing. We just failed stealth. Yup. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> that Beautiful is Raven awesome. walked in the room just in time to see this. <laughs> oh, that was so cool. Yeah, B just went, what the fuck? <laughs> but I know that Tim will get my kidneys. Uh, what else will Rock shake off? I mean, <laughs> a toe? <laughs> yeah, a toe seems like a reasonable thing to auction off. Good oh, by the Good way, boy. yeah, if, if you quit the game, it just shows you the credits. <laughs> so, yeah, the real of course. They don't let so, you quit real easy. Nope. 
Thanks for uh, playing as a middle finger scrolls by. Joy. So what you're saying is they're flipping the bird. Indeed. Yes. <laughs> Why do they keep flipping the both of you? What? What? Well, I just like getting Birds. flipped, okay? I'm kind of like a meat patty. You flip me around and I'm good to go. Uh... Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Den of Games, where last time I blue balled us continuing this dungeon. Uh huh. Good. It felt like you were just right there, you know? Things are just about to happen. Yes. Yes, yeah, they were just about to happen. Build. Yep, I believe. Actually, um. Buttons? Which button? Oh, uh, here we are. Right, I've got the two meatheads and Maxim. Right. Yep, yep, yep. You got the, the bro crew. You got the tricolor. Ah, tricolor. Love it. The, the trifecta of muscle head, the muscle hood. Uh, does, does he really fit in that though? Like, I, I feel like Maxim at least is not like a complete muscle head. Yeah, true. Hi, they're all walkable. <laughs> they have all ours or tentacles, whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let, let, let's. Oh, I forgot about the super low physical damage we inflict on these guys. Uh huh. I should. The, the I should have used magic. Well, now that just reminds me of a web of a. What is the cool webcomic that I see? Well, comic strips posted on Twitter uh, for Monster Girls, and one of them is the Living Armor, and go figure, she's a chainmail bikini. I mean, of course. How else would you, like, wear uh -huh. chainmail? Uh, other than the fact that the Lynx would catch every fucking... He oh, wait, what? Did that armor just turn into a fucking sword? I think it summoned the sword. Oh, got it. Well, you know what? Uh, no, not uh, this. Little Hunter Wolf, when that's when Teal's tickle feels a little bit more close to home. I mean, that, that, that's that kind of got a nice ring to it, actually. Uh huh. And yes, I totally agree with you, Wolf. Uh, you are definitely spending too much brain power on this. Uh, mm -hmm. Not because I don't appreciate it, but because the brain power could absolutely be used elsewhere. Welcome to the monster races. If a monster arrives at your warp point first, you win. If a monster arrives at another warp point first, the reset spell is cast and you must try again. If you are not on a warp point when the monster arrives, you must try again. You can also use your arrows to block other monsters. Let the race. Oh, what the, the actual begin. fuck is this hell? Oh, and I'm right. Okay. You must cool in the monster game. I mean, I'm really not sure how I feel about this, but let's fucking find out how it goes. Let's go. Oh, this, this was a back attack. This isn't great. Just kicking into the into gear. Alright, so you know what? Water was working fairly well, so we're gonna keep doing that. Um, it's just a can't little do that. Oh, yeah, that's. Well, that was a wash. Yeah, Maxim is definitely, definitely not our uh, our big hitter this time yeah. around. Is that why you have it with the front lines right in the back? This is a back attack. Oh, right. Green. Yeah, I'm getting fucked in the ass and it's not pleasant. My armor that's gonna be really cold. Really rough. I just really... Rust. See, I just really, really hope there's no rust. That's all. Yeah. 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 Or worse if there's spikes like the Shredder's armor. Oh. Yeah, that's me. Mm, yeah, no. Oh, that is that. Yeah, that's a like. I don't like that thought. Right, time to finish off the deadly sword, and we can just move on. There we go. Move on with our lives. 
Yay. Uh, to which, hey Max, how about you oh, cast a, a wee bit of a spell to heal your friends? <laughs> For a moment here, I thought you were going to press the reset, but then it pissed all the laughter ass off. I mean, it, you know, she uh, no, she's not really uh, present, so she would um, she would not have known unless someone told her. But, you know, clips. Those have been useful, right? Right. Oh, crap. Hey. Buddy. Can you please, for the love of fuck... <laughs> you got there first previously, and you're gonna tell me you're just not gonna fuck... Oh, god damn it. Oh, this is gonna be annoying. See, they call this monster races. I call this RNG bullshit. Yes, that's about right. Hey. Cool. This feels like it was. Feels like that was gonna be the worst of the RNG, so we got it out of the way. Yay. Yep. The corridor. I thought it's out of control, to two rocket. Yep. Corridor outside went down. Wait, yeah. when they say the corridor, do they mean the platform, like, completely yeah. outside? Yeah. Oh, my, they called it a corridor. Oh, my sweet Christ. Okay, so that's... Alright, cool. Whatever. That's over and done with. Uh, well, it did not mean to go down. All I wanted to do was leave. All I wanted to do was see you turn into a giant lizard. No. Uh, yeah, I'd rather not, please, thanks. Um, yeah, sorry about that. I was taking a, a, a nice little chug there because I, uh, I wanted some juice to, to hydrate. Hydrate. So let's do a round of physical attacks. Oh, no, that's actually... That, oh, headbutt. It's dead. Yep, beautiful. That's dead. Cool. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. And we got a life potion. This, this worked out well. And, oh. Yeah, there we go. Use the cloud key. Okay, we've got stairs leading up. Ancient Tower hey. 7F. Hey, this looks important. Well, here's the thing, though. It, you're right. It looks important, but there are two other warps I didn't use. So, I guess I have a question. Do they bring somewhere else, or do they all bring to the same place? I just had to try to get the one that was going to arrive first. I, I believe it was all the same place. Okay, so I'm not missing anything if I don't do the other two warps. Yeah. I'm missing. Good to know, because I was, I was about to start wasting some fucking time. Was it the races? It certainly was a day at the races. You know what? I am curious. Increases HP to maximum. Okay, so full heals that we're getting from this snake dude. I like it. An elixir, you know. Yep. That it's so good, I will never use it because I keep thinking I'm gonna keep it for a different fight where I'm desperately needing it. Mm. And then when I'm desperately needing it, I'll be like, "No, I'll find a way without using this item that could really fix everything." Also, hey, fuckface, Gates, you again. You were defeated once. Why do you keep trying? You have no chance. That remains to be seen. Why do you not cease your senseless resistance? 
You need only bow down before us to live. You asked for the impossible. For you have destroyed the whole... For you have destroyed whole cities for no reason. I will bow down to no one. So you beat us once. Don't let it get to your head. You are merely foolish mortals after all. After all, prepare for the end. Great music. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna take a second to, to take another drink, but also to fucking appreciate this music. <laughs> am I am I wrong to feel like there's a bit of Mega Man X in there? But it was the old guitar behind it. I can hear that. All right. Let's let's see what's up. Oh Jesus, fuck! Oh oh, two fifty four with the headbutt. Fuck oh, yeah! Oh, I'm, sur I'm not surviving, but that felt good. Because I'm not going to lie, like, Guy right now, he, he, he's looking pretty rough. Yeah, but it's like peace, Phil. Yeah, but the, I'm going to defend so he doesn't, well, hopefully he doesn't die. And hopefully I have time to freaking heal him with a life potion. Good plan. Or... Ready to go? Oh. I can't use life potions. What? Oh, they're outside of battle only, huh? Well, high potion it is. Hopefully Miracles that'll be enough. So good for it. Oh boy. Oh, guy's dead. Oh. Nope! Guy survives because he was defending. Oh wait, he wasn't even defending yet. Fuck. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Oh, uh, do yeah, you I don't... fear? I still feel like I'm not even meant to win this fight, but I'm still gonna give my damn best try. Uh, now that just makes me think of uh, Dragon Ball Z Bridge. Oh god. Bow down to your king! What is a king to a god? What is a god to a non believer? Slap! Do you believe now? Oh wow, that, that's actually a pretty good exchange. Uh, you know what? Let's try slowing him down. See if that won't help. I, that did, did damage? I, that, that, yeah, like, I... I damaged him? Like, what? Question mark, question oh. mark, question mark? Oh, yeah, I have so many fucking questions right now about what just happened there. Oh, at least he spared Guy. Heal like, Guy again. Not too hot. Uh, look, this is a stupid battle of attrition that I'm not winning because I've got shit healers and no items. Uh huh. It's like chasing the, the woman away here was a bad idea or something. Of course it was. I just couldn't do anything else because or else they'd have to admit they were useless without the women. Oh. The, oh god, healing 25. Yeah, Fum Fumi's running away. I figured that much. Uh, um, alright, yeah, we, we just gotta keep... S Actually, what do you have? Reviver. Restores fight power. Restores Reviver. HP by 50. Uh, you know what? Oh, okay, yeah, it's not an actual... Yeah, it's, uh, it keeps down, pretty much. Yeah, Thunderball, Divine Cure. Restores the HP of each member. Oh! The fucking, yeah, okay. Guy's the one with the heals, uh, but he's dead. he's dead. Oh, but wait, I was using Reviver with Dekar, so it works. <laughs> it fucking works, but now he's got no IP, though, so I'm kind of screwed on that end. Ah, uh, oh, that is amazing yet terrible how that just kind of worked out. 
You know what, guy? Uh, oh, yeah, that car is... Oh, well, his thing is full, though, so if, if he doesn't get hit next turn, he can do the things. But, yeah, I am I am very quickly running out of things I can do to keep myself alive yeah, here. Yeah, we're just... Miracles will also be a full refill. Oh, yeah, you're right. But I don't want to use that, so we're just going to use my remaining high potion. Uh... Guy's just going to swing, and here we're going to strong and hopefully keep this fucker. Oh, well, goodbye, Maxim. All right. Uh, let's go, baby. Let's, let's do it. We're just going to start swinging like crazy. Swing for defenses. Uh, no, we're swinging to deal damage, not for defenses. <laughs> well, against his defense. Yes, we are swinging against his defense. That is very true. Alright, there goes Guy. Deckers. Um... Alright, and let's find out if I was right. Total defeat. Please tell... Oh, no. I need to win. <laughs> Fuck. Well... Um, okay, we are going to leave this place so I can fucking go cry in a corner somewhere. Yeah. I have to do a few levels, maybe. I'm sorry, what? Come back after a few levels. It, levels isn't even my issue, I feel. It's just outright getting having items to heal my stupid ass because I'm a yeah. melee only... Like, an almost exclusive melee, like, party right now. And because prior to, I was like, ah, I won't need healing items. Like, it, it's, uh, it's fine. Like, we're, we're doing fine. I, I was wrong. I was very wrong. And, okay, yeah, this is the top. Cool. Oh no, your weapons and armor. I don't need weapons and armor. I need fucking items. Where? Oh yeah, it's in the basement. The item shop dude is in the basement. Which, I don't know, doesn't make sense and to me, but here we are. Great. Uh, restores the HP, restores fight power, and okay. You know what? I wonder if... Hmm. Who was... Hitting the hardest. I think it was Decker that was hitting the hardest at like 150. Yep. Decker was definitely the hard hitter. Well, that and, you know, our god, the savior Fumi. Oh, well, yeah, like obviously Fumi was just doing like stupid amounts of damage. Um, you know what? These are cheap. Let's buy just a fuck ton, and Maxim is going to become a uh, Final Fantasy Tactics chemist. Bye. Just gonna fucking huff, huff potions like every fucking turn. And now that I know that uh, guy has like the armor that gives a fuck ton of healing and shit, we're gonna focus healing on him with uh, Maxim. And then when shit gets real, we're gonna switch to healing with him using his thing. Exactly. Yep, his IP. Is that a triple property? I didn't know you had any of those. Wait, what? I was saying we were using his IP. Oh. Ah, oh, you funny. <laughs> no, you know what? We are going to flee straight up. Boomy doing a valiant bit of. Oh, come on, you stupid bull. You know That's what? Fuck it. You, bull. you officially um, made me upset. We're going to wreck your face now. <laughs> Except apparently I'm slower than these bulls, so that's kind of terrifying. Am I well, most longer... humans tend to be stored in bulls. Uh, yeah, okay, that's fair.
While we're climbing up back at, up the tower here, here's a little discussion here, a hypothesis. Uh, it's been a while since you've played Dead by Daylight. Well. And uh, some people were wondering here if it was a long time since they would have had a new horror franchise guest star in a fashion coming from a video game. But what would be a good video game horror character that could fit in? I mean, they could bring back Alma from uh, Fear. Ooh. I've never played the Fear, but I heard she was pretty famous for that, so I can't get behind that. What else could fit? Bring on a big from... huh? Huh? Break out the big daddy from Bioshock? I'd have to disagree. Although Bioshock does have some horror elements, it's mostly a philosophical... Like, it, it's more like it pokes your mind and it's a shooter. It's not really horror. Um... On the flip side, though, what we could throw out there would be a um, so a zombie, a um, a zombie from The Last of Us, like one of the like final form mutation things. Um, I can see that, but I get a feeling it would be real close to the dredge. Oh well, look, I, I don't even remember most of the like uh, the killers that are currently out. Don't blame you, but yeah, if they're gonna go with the, something from a different franchise, they probably go with one of the major characters, not the minion behind it. The problem, in part, is that almost all of the enemies in that are not zombies in. Um, Oh god, words in The Last of Us are all non supernatural, non enhanced humans. Makes sense. They, they don't always have to be to be enhanced either. You say that, but name me a vanilla human, like pure vanilla human that isn't dead by daylight. Did you? Really? Yeah, I believe that. Technically, they're just a bunch of humans. Different oh. characters, but they're all under Legion. I didn't know that they were just vanilla. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I have double check. I thought they had here. some supernatural thing going on with them. No, well, if there um, is, I don't remember it. I may have missed. There's a few uh, very famous enemies from the most recent Doom games that would work out really well. I can see that. I can see that. Definitely monstrous enough. Recently, we just had the, uh, the Xenomorph added in. Oh, yeah, that's true. I heard about that. A lot of people were also expecting the, uh, the Predator to show, to make a showing, but that's not video game, of course, here, and. Yeah. I believe some people were also thinking that they were planning to make a. The Predator one, a Predator character, but he somehow didn't get a license, and that's how we ended up with a Skull Merchant. Mm -hmm. We also had the one that was uh, kind of robotic in the. Uh, I don't know, I can't remember the name of it. Was it the glitch? The uh, component? Yeah, robot. An alien robot style. The, the story is that there's a, a group of space explorers that uh, a group of space explorers that went over there here, they had a drone that was helping them and so the drone started acting up. Oh. Because of course it did. Because of course. Because we can't have nice things. Well, of course not. Oh, god damn it. I well, no, we're we are going to flee. I'm to reset again. Don't need to reset. I just... Well, I mean... Yes and no. There we go. 
There we go. There you go. I took one step too many, and that fucked me over. Yep. All needed. recent trends in the horror style game that we've had. I mean, I guess you could Five Nights at Freddy's. Some people were bouncing ideas about that one here, but I don't know. It's possible, I suppose. I mean, it's a video game, it's a horror game, and the, and the thing you do thing. is very is very specifically hunt down fucking people, so you know. Yeah, true. It makes sense. I think we also have a movie coming out at the end of the month. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting about that. Yep. Oh well, there's a level. Can I pass? No. Oh. Um. Ah yes, the fake door. Forgot about that. Yep. Kill the snacks. Kill the snacks. Snacks. Kill the snacks. I mean, um, one of I guess. Uh, if you want to go really old school, they could take Eve from Parasite Eve. Ah, uh, yeah, that you know what? I'd love to see that. I'm curious what kind of power they have, but yeah, I'd love. To. Okay, yeah, I'll... I had not thought yeah. about that one. But look, I just it's something that popped in my head, and I was like, you know. It's a horror game, like, it would work. There it is. Oi. I don't think Big Butter Classic in horror game with that. Unfortunately, the thing that keeps popping up back in my mind is still Silent Hill. But... I mean, isn't there already a Silent Hill, uh... Yeah, Pyramid Head. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Pyramid Head isn't... Yeah, I've, I've even played against Pyramid Head, yeah. Uh-huh. I had to play as him earlier today. Oh, nice. Indeed. Oh um, no, no, that the Nintendo would never allow that to happen. What? Why not suddenly went why not my first mask? I mean, it would be cool as fuck. It might actually get <laughs> yeah. me to play the game again, but like <laughs> But yeah, like in terms of like it will that happen? No. no. All right, you know what? Sorry, buddy. You need to remove the, the muscle ring. We need you to be smarter so you can heal more. Is that maximum your pal, then? He is my Paladin. Indeed. No, no, not indeed. I said Paladin. Buddy. Onyx Killer, Bubsy! You know, that would be horrifying, but for entirely different reasons. Yeah. Uh, um, oh, that just reminds me of another video I watched earlier today about uh, developers that hated working on their games. Oh, okay. Um, what games were showcased, including Bubsy? <laughs> Let me see here. Uh, I have to remember the whole thing, but Bubsy wasn't just there for one entry, like... Everybody starting the second game all the way through had somebody who dis despised being on the project. Yeah, I'm not surprised. <laughs> Including somebody that, when they went on the, um, the original creator of Bubsy after the, well, from the, from the top of Bubsy, seemingly, when the, the guy who pitched Bubsy over to the 
publishers. The publishers were so hyped about this year that they thought they had the next Sonic. That they started doing merchandising, promotions, pitching cartoons before the game was even done. And wow. It nearly bankrupted the company just how hard they pitched that game. That hilariously terrible. Uh, and unfortunately, not as good as they thought. And at some point, the, the guy who made Bubsy left the company. But the company start, thought, okay, yeah, we have to do a Bubsy 2. We, we, we did that here. They got themselves a new head of development. They started building on it here. Everybody who worked on Bubsy 2 hated it. Which is why there's so many little project to it. And, and even to the point where, well, I don't have full confirmation on it yet, and I believe uh, all I could directly find was an interview about part of it. But when the original guy who created Bubsy went over there for visits at a point, when he walked into the offices, he saw multiple plushies of Bubsy with a string wrapped around their neck and hung from the ceiling. And the head developer uh, that had replaced him had a Bubsy plush with a pencil stuffed into its eye. Hi! Uh, wow! You know you yeah. hate what you're doing when. Oh, yes. Um, after that, for Bubsy on the Jaguar here, well, they had to deal with Tyre to make one of the. Okay, for it. it was supposed to be just a port of the original Bugsy, but somebody opened their mouth and said, yeah, who wants to pay for a new console for a game that's available and everything else? So they had to build a big new game out of that, and that did not help. Oh, I feel so bad for these people. Like, it's such a, a terrible fate to behold. Uh-huh. And uh, the, for Bugsy 3D... Um, similarly, the voice actress uh, only had regrets about her role. Wow, wait. Oh, because the, the voice actress, the voice for Bubsy is a female voice? Yes. Oh, wow. Yep. I have to double check the video again here. Right. Like, send me that, send that my, okay, so we've talked Bubsy. What other games were in that video? Let me pull it up, uh, I believe. One of the games that was on there here, and I don't remember the full details, but uh, Postal 3. Postal 3? Yes. That's oddly specific. Yep, seemingly. They, they hated the game so much that uh, in the game right afterwards, there's a whole bunch of achievements about finding the game and uh, pissing the heck out of it. Oh, wow. Yeah, like, seemingly, um, because they switched so many hands at some point, and they had so many other parts, that one of the interviews said here, at this point, they said they had to launch the game, they had no ways to be able to edit it, to change it, to test it, to do anything on it except launch it as is. And so that's why it's such a trash fire. That's bad. The, even the DLC for the game, Pretty much starts with the whole thing saying that the whole of Postal 3 was actually a nightmare concussion that the protagonist got during car crash. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. Like, you it know. was that bad. I was gonna say, you know it's bad when they're like, hey, the whole game you just played, we disown it. Yep. Like, no. Oh wow, we just hit our first 300 and something with a main title character. Nice. That's that's a good crit. Probably helped that I have it... the right element to fuck it up proper. Oh no, wait, he's using the deadly sword. Never mind. You saw Game Boy Color version of uh, Lufia 2 or I'm Sucker? Oh, seemingly it's a very odd version. Interesting. Please expand. Oh, 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 no. Um, what was the name of that team? Now, 
back to the uh, developers ahead in making uh, the game. Uh, seemingly, Suda64 uh, had a problem with uh, one of his game. Which game? I can't remember the name of it yet, so I need to find a caption for it. Let's see, let's mm. see. Because, like, I'm actually kind of a fan of his work, so, like, I, I want to know. Oh, yeah. Oh, so the G GBC game is Lufia The Legend Returns. Ah, uh, yeah, but the, is that the one? Um, no, wait, the one uh, V said was on the DS was completely different. And I believe we'll be playing that at some point. Oh, or do we have to? Seemingly. Huh. Huh. Right. Randomly generated dungeon maps, apparently. <laughs> Oh, joy. Would you say they were procedurally generated? Herkader. <sighs> you know, I hate how much time we've uh, we've spent in this tower because of me fucking up against the boss. Huh? Cause you can't quite pass there. Like, I mean, like, I'll get back to it. It just... I really was hoping for some good progress, and this is not it. No, because unfortunately that... Unfortunately, you don't have much in the way of heals, which was kind of central to a whole lot of progress you've done so far. Yeah... Okay. Yeah... I found the name of the game, uh, Shadows of the Damned. Oh, it, I, I had a feeling that's the game that had issues, and I'm not surprised, in a way. Because seemingly, originally, Suda wanted it to be a survival horror, which is great when you think that he had the... He was working with the people who made Resident Evil and Silent Hill behind him. Yep. He was supposed to be a guy going down to hell and uh, with only a torch for his beginning weapon. And... It was all based on some work too. Here was supposed to be very philosophical or personal base, and uh, 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 then, uh, uh, then oh. EA decided to shove their head in. Uh, oh, look. Okay, so you're describing to me what it was supposed to be, and I was comparing it to what I knew the game to be, and I'm like, uh -huh. oh wow, like no wonder he probably didn't like that project. It is so uh, fucking far from what he would have originally wanted. Like, holy oh, shit. Oh, yes. Then he, he started here. Well, now he has to have a gun. He has to have a gun. No, no questions asked. Then soon they decided that the gun would have a little persona inside of it here, like a little pretty woman that would go inside of it here and help and guide and such. And he said, yeah, no, that ain't happening either. Yeah. So, yeah, so instead, the, the dad became the, the dance of distress instead, and we got the skull guy instead. Did Boomy just do a new move called Tackle that yep. cleared out two out of the three enemies, uh, two out of the four, and what was left afterwards was not a whole fucking lot? Uh huh. Okay, he Damn, did this Fumi. New for a little while here. Oh yeah, it's just we we hadn't seen tackle yet, so that was that was fucking something. And for Shadow of the Dam here, the what the good news seemingly about it is that uh, the license was worth so little on the idea that EA sold it back to Suda, and uh, he took that uh, for his uh, one of the. Uh, A three, come on. What were the other games that he had on it? Oh, so basically, like, he was able to get reparation, in a sense? In a fashion, because he went on the 
no more heroes, and they had uh, Travis Strikes again, I believe. Oh, yep. It was uh, the top, the top down hanging slash. Yep. And one whole chapter is referencing how he felt when he made that game. Oh, wow. Yeah, the, the skull that's supposed to be holding all that here is uh, technically the final boss of that chapter. Oh. Yeah. And seemingly, they're making the work of having a remake of that game. Oh. Well, and if Suda has the rights to the game, then he can do whatever the fuck he wants with it at that point. Uh-huh. Here's the one going to pull on that at that point. Same, honestly, because, like... I knew there was some trouble with the development, I just didn't realize how bad it was. Mm -mm. And uh, as for the video, the other game that they mentioned in there here was uh, L.A. Noir. Wait, L.A. Noir? Yeah. Interesting. Seemingly, partly because of the guy in charge. Like, people were placed so often, it was like, turning, like, turning door and such, and it Revolving was incredibly door. bad. Wow. Because of that. Oh, that's... Oh, that's terrible, yeah. Mm -hmm. And if I... Mind you, my understanding is that uh, Alien War was done by the same team that did... Um... Oh, fuck, I've got the tip on my tongue, dear. Nope, okay, my brain just decided to blank out. I can't even, like, word. Um, I have to double check on the full details here, and I can't quite listen to the video at the moment here. But the team was technically relatively new. But at right. some point, things got delayed so much that uh, the the owners suddenly became uh, uh, the, the people who made GTA. Rockstar. Oh, Rockstar, yeah. Yeah, they became the o the owner, and they started taking care of or, or taking over things. But even then, it wasn't exactly uh, great. Yeah, it doesn't sound like it was. Mm -hmm. Also, that, that reminds me of another video from. Uh, I believe you watch a guy here, but how the. How the game the guy who made the first uh, Street Fighter, or rather the uh, the first Final Fight, right? Uh, Similarly, in one version, really hated uh, working on that game too. Oh, really? Yep. And uh, so much so that there's a hidden message in one of the versions of the games on how he hated production on it so much. Weird. Yeah. Oh wow. Oh, that, that was easy. Jesus, that went fast. Fantastic, I love it. Thank you, RNG. Yep, RNG Jesus was smiling down on us this time. Hallelujah. You know what? And so I just don't have to do this again. Oh, whoops. Save. <laughs> But yes, we are we are going to save. I like your plans. I like your funny words, Magic Man. <laughs> and I posted a video in the dead discussions. Perfect. I'm probably gonna have a look at that tomorrow. Indeed. Enjoy. Someone leveled up. <laughs> All right. So you know what? Since we know what we're getting into, let's get a few high potions. Make sure that everyone is max health. 
And let's fucking go, baby. And it was just a big music game. Yeah, we'll get to listen to the good music again. Alright, um... So, to start... You use a water attack. You were saving your thing for later, because God knows we're gonna need it. And you know what? We already know that um, we're gonna get clobbered, so you know what? We're gonna... Oh, and he hits Fumi. Great. Like, the one person I was expecting to be, like, the hardest hitter of the group is probably gonna bail super fast because of that. That sucks. He's possible. Oh, that water attack did plenty of damage, so we're gonna do that again. I like it. Percy. Yeah, really. Okay, so we're done with those for now. Swing and then spell. Yep, glad I decided to heal him. I mean. Ooh, tackle, nice. And then it struck the wave he's paid for as ever. I mean, it is a oh, whole headbutt, fuck yes! Like, it is it is painful, don't get me wrong, but I prefer, I actually prefer the Destructo Wave to just his, like, regular straight attack. Yeah, because that one might just take someone out. Yes, exactly. Uh, you know what, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna split the healing between every, oh, Maxim took the hit. That's okay, because I'm still healing everyone. Mm. Yep, just gonna hit everyone. It's gonna suck. Yeah, Fumi's dead. That's really sad, actually. Bomb attack's not gonna do anything. I forgot I had stronger on the mind ring, which I didn't have in the previous fight, so oh that's probably gonna save my ass, so we're gonna We're just gonna swing, baby. Well, I'm swinging. Alright, well, while you're still alive, unless you get hit again, you're gonna do your water attack, you're gonna swing, and then we're gonna do stronger on you. Oh, fucker. Yo, he's alive. He is a fucking lie, baby. Oh, well, stronger apparently healed him enough that he's surviving well. Nice. And it didn't completely deplete my IP gauge, which means it is... This is the item I need to win this fight, apparently. Maybe stronger, faster, make us harder, make it do 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 do. It's been a while since I've heard that. Sometimes my brain goes back to weird things. It happens. Oh my god! The fight is done! I've won! Nice! DG! Ten? Oh my god, that's a lot of money in XP. Fuck yeah. Oh, yeah. How? How can it be? Mere mortals with such power? Oh, no. The corridor! Oh, no! Oh, fuck. This doesn't look good. Now, with same island thinking, I will take everyone in Parcelite with me. Yo, Max, you, uh, you mind stabbing him in the chest while he's talking? 
Ha. Ha. Logging. Ha. Yup. Ha. Maxim. That voice, could it be? Oh, hey, the girls are finally here. Tian Slan, where have you, why have you come here? I was just so worried about you. I couldn't. Slan, why did you stop her? I'm sorry, but I was worried too. Well, we've got to get out of here. What about you? Gades pressed the switch before he died. Something here has to do with the thinking. I must find out. I'll go with you. The corridor's collapsed. You can't cross. The tower's ready to fall. Get out while you can. No, I can't leave you behind. Tia, you have to understand. It's not safe here. No, Tia. Well. I can say that. So it's okay for Maxim to die as long as your parcelite is safe. No, that's not true. We can't do anything right now. Don't you realize we're in this? We're in his way. Actually, yes, you are in my way. The sooner you just fuck off, the sooner I can fix shit. Uh, but if something happens to Maxim, Maxim can handle this, and you know it. Of course I do. I believe in him, so I'll wait for him in Parcelite. Parcelite, yes. Dylan will not sink. Maxim will stop it from sinking. All right, let's get out of here. Guy with the fucking like, let's just fucking go, people. Uh, Maxim, promise me that you'll come back. I'll be waiting for you. Up top, Captain. Oh, yay, I'm alone. It's great. I hate I'm it. I'm sure you got Fumi with you. Okay, you know what? That right there is a fantastic point. Everything will be a honky dory. I've got Fumi. Uh -huh. Your lord and savior, Fumi yes. the Great. Um. Alright. That's. Well, I mean, there's a save point, but except for the save, that's kind of. That was anticlimactic. Mm. Alright, let's do it. Alright. Yeah, yeah, they kind of got a problem with that. Oh, it's got friends! Fuck it, we're out. Uh, bombs destroyed the red. Okay. If destroy the red, you can't do the dead. Oh, the companion's phase. Great. I love it. <laughs> uh, you know what? Let's see if Flash does any significant damage. Yes, it does. We are going hey. to be using... We are going to be using this. Uh, no, I didn't mean to escape, but fuck it. You know what? Let's go. Let's just go. Yeah, let's just run. Yeah, so that was blue. Red was down here. Yeah. Okay. So um. We got your bomber man. Yes, we'll break out the bomber man. Hey, red's dead. Red is dead. You know what? Blue was down here, but now that I've got like an, a significant idea of what's going on. Oh, fuck. Ah, of course. You know what? Fuck it. We're just gonna... We're, we're gonna do this. Let's go, baby. Master in! Master in! Man, I'm, I'm sad that the Fumi punch, that's all it did. Punch can only last so long. Alright, just stupid cursed aren't up right. Physical attacks don't do shit! Unless you got muscles like Guy or Dickar. Yeah, really. Oh, let's do that. Wait, maybe equipping an elemental weapon in this case would be much more functional to deal with the situation. Do you have any? I do, I just, you know, I can't equip shit during a fight, but once I'm outside the fight, I think I can get that sorted out. God, these fuckers are annoying! Hmm. 
Ma I'm sorry, what? What? I just got a fucking magic bikini. Yep. You heard it here, folks. A magic fucking bikini. Look, if if oil can be armor, I'm sure bikini can do the job. Yes, but at least slick oil gets applied to everyone. I mean... It did. How can I say this here? In, in sound clips. You are technically correct. The best kind of correct. Correct? Yes, exactly. That's, that's the whole point here. Uh-huh. Fuck, I, I ignored a instruction tablet and I probably should not have. Arrows pierce the blue, okay, cool. That's I don't care about that really. Uh fuck. Okay, well let's see if the ice rapier Oh my sweet Christ, the ice rapier really works. <laughs> cool. Now, to be fair, Wolf, I agree with you. I agree with the attitude of Yas Queen, Bikini, you know what? Yes, empowerment. Yes, but... Queen Slay. <laughs> there we go. Too simple for my dummy brain. I did it! Yay. Oh, I'm dying. And Nudra set the device in this tower. Oh, who's... Oh, oh! Mm. Well! The way she showed up tells me that she ain't a good person. Is this Parslight? How did I get here? Maxim! Oh, what's the land? I guess Parslight's okay then. Yes! Is everyone alright? Yes, people in the city, Guy, Dekar, and Tiara, everyone's just fine. Good, that's a relief. I owe everything to you. No, that's not true. I couldn't have done it alone. Yeah, I guess, but you're really something. You finally give me credit, I see. No. Still? I mean, I have for a long time. Plan. Maxim, I'm so... It's nice to see you again. What's wrong? I knew you were coming back, and I know this is no miracle. You are standing here. Actually, it is, kind of. About that? Yet... You're here. You're really here. You're not going anywhere again, right? I... I... Oh, girl. You catch and feel? That's, that's really hard. Plan, are you crying? You said girls shouldn't cry so easily. <laughs> Okay, kid, there's a matter of perspective here. Back off. Mm -hmm. It's okay, little lady. It's okay to cry right now. Oh, hey, girl. You, um... You okay? I thought you were in love with Maxim. Yes, I am, but it's okay. You know what? I couldn't cry. So? My name, Tia. Like, Tear. Because of this, I was always teased and I was always crying. Maxim always saved me, and one day he said people tease you because you cry easily. So I tried not to cry, no matter how hard kids tease me. Then they stopped. I've never cried since then, and I couldn't even cry if, uh, when I really wanted to. Maybe I can't just can't cry anymore. You're wrong. Why'd you say that? Because if you catch these hands, you'll cry real hard. Oi. The time hasn't come when you'll really want to cry. To be sure, Maxim is a kind man, but you two live in different worlds, and you know it. Yeah, I noticed that when Maxim said he was going. It's okay now. I found out something at the tower. I'm in love with Maxim, but not Maxim the warrior. Not the warrior? <laughs> Dekar is officially confused. He's like, but why would you uh -huh. not love the warrior? <laughs> oh, God. I chased him to the tower because I was worried. I just didn't have faith in him as a warrior. The mere thought that we might never see again, never again meet, sent me after him. 
and I put him in danger. But Selene said she'd wait. She believed in him. I waited too, but the thought of something awful happening to Maxim just kills me. I don't think I can bear feeling this way every time Maxim goes to battle. It's true that I love him even now, but that's why I don't want to be in his way. You're not going to say goodbye to him? No, if I see him now, I may cry. I decided long ago that I'm not going to cry so easily. You will someday. I mean, your tears haven't dried out yet. Thanks, you really helped, you know. I feel a lot better now. Hm. I am great at swordsmanship, but I'm also great at cheering people up, you know? Oh, mm. that, 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 that brag hurts a little mm. bit. <laughs> Thanks, really. Tell Maxim I'll find someone just as good as him. That car's like, hey, baby. <laughs> Oi. Um, there's a wedding ceremony? Excuse me? Yep. I, um, I'm pressing things, but nothing's happening. Hey, you're gonna have to wait, I'm afraid. Oh, wow, okay, that's like they wanted the wedding ceremony to be there for, like, a good long while. Delightful. I'm sorry. Okay, this is not what I was expecting. Uh -huh. Congratulations, Selene. You look so beautiful. Madame, Selene, you are. You're really getting married. Hey, stop crying. This is the happiest day of her life. It's been only a month since Maxim returned. They rushed into the marriage, all right. Hey, guy, what about your girlfriend? Isn't she asking you to get married, too? Oh. Yeah, but women don't understand the adventurous male spirit. Warriors don't need women. Hmm. Bro, <laughs> you're gonna get dropped real fast. So is that how you really feel about us, guy? Whoa, whoa, Jesse, what are you doing here? I'm here for the wedding. If you really feel that way, I can leave you any time. Hey, now, I was just joking, Jesse. I need you. You know that. Uh-huh. Sure, guy. Come on, Justy, I mean it. I was just joking. Hey, wait up. Well. So that's a true warrior, huh? I guess that's the way they show each other. No, that is so fucking toxic. Don't agree mm -hmm. with that. Hey, Slime, you look really cool in that wedding dress. Those are not... I mean, you know what? No, I approve of Dekar instead of complimenting her super... Like, you know beauty is like, you look cool. I like it. Thanks. Commander's land. Monsters are in the southern part of the castle. We need your help. <laughs> you guys, it's our wedding day. Can't you be a little bit more sensitive? But Slan, aren't you hiding your sword under your dress? Um, <laughs> that's what Ooh, she la, la. said? Uh-huh. That was supposed to be his sword, then after the reception, but... The look, you know what? However they want to do it, whatever. Yeah, what you know about that, thing? huh? I feel like something's missing without it. But you too, Maxim, have your sword too, right? Yeah, baby, never leave home without it. <laughs> well, uh, this is like a part of me. Please, Commander. I guess I have to. What do you think, Maxim? The wedding needs some sort of attraction like this, don't you think? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, boy. Well... Oh, well, Maxim, I heard you're off to battle. I'll join you. Oh, oh, guy, whatever happened to talk about our wedding? Maxim Slan, I'll go ahead and meet you guys later, okay? Jesus, this guy. Yes, this guy, indeed. <laughs> Shall we, Slan? Yes, sir. I thought the idea was to put the knife into the wedding cake and not into monsters. In some cases, it might be both. Correct. Well, I guess it's their style. I'd better go ahead and give them a hand. It's their wedding day. It's alright, they can deal with ordinary monsters easily. As long as villains like Gadi stay away, this world will remain at peace. Yeah, thanks to Maxim's risking his life to defeat Gades, we now have this precious peace. Indeed, Maxim's really some guy. Um, no, he's uh, not that's some the other guy. Man. That's the other guy, yeah. Oy. Oh no, that's for sure. in spring. Hello, I'm home. 
Hi! Hmm, something smells good. Doesn't it? I tried something different today. Really? What is it? I deep fried jelly in all of a... I'm sorry, what? Yeah! You deep fried jelly in olive oil. Yeah. Huh. Is it, you know, um, edible? Didn't I just say I tried something different? Did it work? Ha <laughs> ha. Huh. About that. You sure as know how to pick them. Mm-hmm. So I have a question. Yeah? What the fuck is happening right now? That skips, I believe. You don't say. Ah. It's really... It's really hot. Yep, it's summer, all right. Splan, aren't you going to the sea this year? Let's see. Maxim, are we going to the sea? The sea, huh? That sounds good. Splan's sim suite has two parts, top and bottom, and so tiny. Oh, Jesus. Really, kid? Like, chill. Two pieces, huh? Tiny, huh? Hmm. Damn, that squad. He's like, yeah, baby, you gotta wear it. Mm -hmm. That was last year. You wear something like that when you're young. I'll wear the one piece. Hmm. Look, you two are wet already. Uh, uh. No, 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 look. You are always, always allowed to simp and, sl and drool over your partner. That should never, like, mm -hmm. never stop doing that. Can't what? Right now. Oh, oh, no, okay. don't mind me. I was taking a drink. Uh, I suppose that. Um, see, I, I guess now I'm just concerned that, like, Baby Bum's going to pop up eventually. And if not, then does that imply that Maxim is sterile? What? That's all? It's the perfect season for training. Can't you keep it up a little longer? Y yes, sir. I see you're still as strong as ever, Commander. You think so? But I haven't been practicing much since I got married. Right, Maxim? Yeah, no, that's not the exercise you've been doing, clearly. No, but you wave your sword around a lot when we fight. That's scarier than a real battle. <laughs> Oof. So that's her secret. You're probably the only one strong enough to be her husband, Sir Maxim. That's just a spousal abuse, man. That's not cool. Uh -huh. It certainly isn't an easy job. I get more nervous fighting Saland than monsters, you know. You're not implying that I'm worse than monsters, I hope. Well, sometimes. Maxim! Oh, well. And that's how the yes, fight started. Yes, Woo, incredible s'moresmanship. Really, they are quite a pair. I also wonder if the people who wrote this script meant to do an anime of this instead. I mean, okay, we are passing through the whole fucking four seasons here. Like, I'd like to be able to save and go to bed, please and thank you. <laughs> It's almost been a year since we were married. It's gone by so fast. I know. Are you happy, Selen? Can't you tell? I think I know. Hey, do you love me? Do I have to tell you? Yes. So you're going to make me say it. I need to hear it sometimes. Oof. Selen, I... Oh, I... Isn't this you... the kind of question you asked about a year ago? Well, there's the baby bump. Fucking knew yeah. it. There's your protagonist of the, of the previous game. Wait, there's only one generation that between what happens, like, at the... Yep! Oh, interesting. Crazy. It's a boy, Salan! My, my baby. Maxim's like, holy fuck, I miss it. Salan! Look, Maxim, it's a boy. He looks just like you. Good job, Salan. Really good job. Yeah. We have to name him. I've been thinking about that. How about Jeros? Jeros, yeah, it's a good name. Yes, he is our Jeros. Good, I was hoping you'd like it. A name you chose? Of course I would. Thanks. Well, well they could have called him Birkingshire Wilhelm III, and that's a missed opportunity. Great. Hi, my love. <laughs> How's Jeros doing? He's sleeping. I thought so. I couldn't hear his voice from outside. That sounds like I'm always making him cry or something. Well, you're not very good at getting him to go to sleep, are you? 
Neither are you. What's that sound? It came from the bedroom. Let me check. You, you, you're Ijira. I've got your little baby. How do you think you're... What do you think you're doing? Orders from one up a high. Who, if it's Gaties, he's history. No, no, not Gaties. Too bad you don't know yet. What are you talking about? Come to the North Lighthouse to find out. Oh, Jesus. Maxim, Jero's our baby. I know, we've got to go to the North Lighthouse. There's your next quest. I... I'm uh -huh. going to be real. I don't know how I feel about everything that just happened. Uh-huh. Like, for one, it felt incredibly rushed. Uh-huh. Yep, yep, yep. For two, there are some cultural things about everything that just happened that have not aged very well, in my opinion. Yeah, yeah, I believe you on that one. And I'm with you all the way on I'm surprised that the initial love interest doesn't stick around and we get married to the girl that comes after. Yeah. Yeah, it, it makes some sense. Like, that's the one thing I can safely say is not something that normally happens in an RPG. No. Normally, the childhood best friend is the girl, you know? Yeah, because she's been with us the whole time. But, but in this case, it was technically foreshadowed because Chicky, that I, whose name I can't remember, that I keep saving our Tia. ass and telling us shit, Dia, yeah. Um, no, no, not Tia, the, the one who literally warped Maxim out of the tower. Ah, uh, yes. Um, has literally said she saw the future of Guy and of Selan and Maxim, but didn't see Tia's future, implying that she wasn't going to be part of the final party, which is fascinating. Uh -huh. All right, yep. well, I've saved. Uh, I am crashing pretty hard, and after wow. everything we just witnessed, I think I, I just need to go have a sit-down. You need to have a rest, huh? Uh, look, I, we just processed a year of information in, like, five minutes. Indeed, indeed. Um, I will also say that there's also some more extra far shadowing on it here with the relationship, considering that of what Tia did love Maxim, as she said here, she did not like the warrior part of it here, and while Salon has a lot more interest with Maxim and what he does, she's got a lot more in common with him. Compared to oh Tio's. yeah, like minus their rush relationship, I don't disagree that they are a much better fit than Tia and Maxim. Yep. And we might say it's rush, but it's because we don't get to see the the whole process of what happened. We skip a whole lot of things. It's a sudden oh. shift for us. But for them, they probably have more time behind that. Well, basically, from the moment uh, Maxim leaves the tower, there's a month that passes. And if we assume that their whole travels from the moment they met and resolved a bunch of mysteries, there's at least another month or two to happen. There's time enough to get to know each other a bit. I just, yep. I guess, and, and this is going to sound weird, but m my opinion is that you could very easily be seven years into a relationship and choose to get married and it could still fall apart later and i guess mm -hmm. marrying after a few months of knowing each other just it always froze me off yeah, yeah because you don't even see that part usually well here, and here's the thing here's the, the the thing on a cultural level there is a reason why like at least on a religious level there's a reason why a lot of people rush to get married is so they can have sex while it being acceptable by their religion. Uh-huh. And I feel like that's kind of what happened here. It's possible. For them to have mm -hmm. a kid, they had to rush into marriage. And see, you know, I, I, you want me to say I love you here, and yeah, that's the kind of thing you want to see before, you know? Yep. And okay, it, you know what? As a side note, it really bothers me that they didn't, that they faded away as Maxim was going to say I love you, because since this game was made in the 90s, 
they couldn't have a male protagonist be gooey, mushy, whatever. They're constantly yeah. doing the whole macho guys don't feel shit thing. But you know, I can't agree on that. But a that bit, quite true. Um, and you know what, Wolf? I totally agree with you. Sex is not a end all be all of a relationship. I really like it. Really is not. Uh, but you're also correct that sexual compatibility is a huge factor that can determine if a relationship is successful or not. Um, so anyways, with all that said, uh, I feel like I, I don't know, man, I, I, I feel so weird about like all that sequence of events. Like it froze me for a loop. <laughs> I don't blame you. That's a whole lot of things that happens. And now we get to, to the next story bit, but that will come on next Saturday. Yep, next week. Boy, but it took us a uh, took us a bit of getting to here, but did finally defeat Gady. So there we go. Yep, kicked his fucking ass to the curb. Indeed. All right. For the schedule on Monday, I'll. Uh, it, this may depend on Kessel if she's feeling better by then here, but we should be going back to Final Fantasy VI if she's feeling right. If not, we'll find something else. And schedule after that would be our back on Tuesday, where we'll probably be finishing off Metroid Fusion. And maybe starting Dread? The possibility is it's there. Depends if uh, V's going to be ready or not for it. That is true. That is very true. Indeed. All right. Well, good night, everyone. Good night, Raven. Have a good sleep. Thanks. Right. Now, as for a stream today, our raid target, uh, I don't see a lot of people active. So I'm going to send this off to Arthur Blue, who seems to be doing a hack of Super Mario 64. So we'll see how that goes. Otherwise, good night, everybody. Until next time.